welcome back to the channel Kuku at Kusi. bienvenue sur ma chaîne so today it's actually a very exciting video because i have received my package and this is the Shantana Beckford um, shirt that she's actually um promoting her face is on it and all that stuff if you follow her on instagram you will see her and her girlfriend taking nice pictures with this shirt i'm super super excited because i'm about to you know finish doing my makeup while telling you guys why i decided to support this uh, movement that she's having and yeah so first if you're new to the channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below give this a thumbs up and also don't forget to follow me on all my social media platform that's instagram twitter and snapchat it will be on the screen and also in the description box down below and now let's get right into this video so as you guys can tell my face is halfway done i already got my foundation on and some light um eyeshadow on because this video is not supposed to be super long technically this video is going to be including an unboxing part and also me telling you guys why i decided to support her movement while finishing my face um yeah don't worry right now the way my face look it will look you know good i'm going for light makeup because i'm about to go take pictures in this shirt in a few so yeah let me first start um I will do my highlight and contour. I will do a very light highlight and contour. So yes, um, I'll unbox at the end of the video. So if you're not willing to watch or hear what I got to say, you can go ahead and skip to the end until I show the shirt and all that good stuff. So yeah, actually, um, I live in the States. And if you don't know Shantana Beckford, she is actually a UK, um, yeah, UK um, YouTuber and influencer overall, you know. Because she's also on Instagram and all that good stuff. So, I am, I was like so pumped. If you follow me on Instagram, which you should. Um, you will know that once I received this package, I posted about it. I couldn't wait, you know, to try it on. Like, I was so pumped. Because not only that, I love her as a person and I love watching her videos. But also, I love the movement overall. Because... If I'm from Cameroon, you guys, most of you guys know I'm from Cameroon, which is in Africa. So, if you know there's a lot of poverty in Africa, like a lot of poverty, you know, there are people that are well off, like anywhere else, but there's a lot of poverty. So, for me to see her, you know, doing this, it was really like, literally the day she posted it, a couple hours later, I got a notification. I got a notification, but a couple, I was in class, so a couple hours later... I just went and purchased it one my once my class was over because I was in class when I got the not notification watched the video after class purchased it right away like I did I had no second thought that's how much I was excited because I feel like a lot of influencers sell their merch and the money goes to them so for her to do this and have the money go to um to help the home the homeless and her having not getting anything out of it I just feel like it's so awesome like she from watching her already, you can tell that she's she's a very caring and loving person. Um, so her doing this was like, yes, like, yes, it's like, you know, thank you in a way. Um, yeah, I live in the state, so I'll receive my order like after I think it took like a week and a half or two weeks to get here, which is great because you know of course it comes from the UK, so that's international shipping and all that good stuff. And it wasn't that expensive as well. When I unbox it, I will tell you guys the price and how much it cost me. But it wasn't as, you know, that expensive. I think that, you know, you guys should definitely check, you know, her page. And also go support what she's doing right now. You guys should definitely go ahead and purchase a shirt. Like I said, I'm from Africa. I'm from Cameroon. Um, in Africa overall, just like anywhere in the world, there's a lot of poverty. But I lived in Africa for a while. And I go visit, like... Most of the time, I go visit every other year. Um, and once I, every time I go there, I always, like, when I come back to the States, I always think, like, oh, my gosh. Like, people are really suffering. Like, God, forgive me for not being so grateful uh, for all the things I have. Because sometimes I do feel like, though, because we are probably not where we want to be, we forget to, like, thank God for what we have. When whole time some people don't actually even have that like they even wish you have the little bit that you have and you are not grateful for so i feel like sometimes i'm personally not so grateful and not so thankful for where i'm at and what i have so 
I think this movement is just great. It's really good because we need to support one another. Because um, for me to be 22 years old and having what I have, you know, I'm not about to sit here and tell you guys everything I have, but for having what I, what I have, what, stay, you know, being where I'm at, you know, even just having my loved one around me is very, 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 you know, it's such a blessing. It's very, very good. So, this is to support the homeless. So, homeless, they have no home, obviously. But not only that, some of them don't even have, you know, any type of support, you know. So, us being, me not knowing, you know, much about the organization that she's, you know, she's helping out, you know. I feel as, I don't see where, I, I see where the money is going. At the same time, I don't see where the money is going, if that makes sense. I see where it's going because, you know, the organization she mentioned, but I physically don't know the place. You know, I've never been there or anything like that. Me helping from afar is even greater, you know. And it also showed me to help those in need. Because if you don't know her story, she was once homeless, okay. So she was one homeless, once homeless, and now look at how she, she's, you know, how she is, how she's living, and she's always grateful. Every time you listen, watch her videos, she always talks about how grateful she is and how she's willing to help those that are below, um, you know, those that are wishing, are willing, and actually wanting to go up. So for for her to do this is such a great thing. Um, I doesn't, I, I don't, I really. I don't come from a wealthy family. I was not poor either, but just the fact that I know how it is to work for what you own and I know how it is not to have certain things that you want to have. I think that, you know, people do need to don't like like do your good deeds, like give give to people that need it. Like and I feel like it's so important to always remind ourselves like not because you're good means that you know, you can't help the person next door. People feel like, oh, I'm good. So I'm, that's so selfish. Technically, they're like, oh, I'm good. You know, so why worry about someone that's not good type thing? And that's super selfish. By the way, don't worry about my hair. I'll fix it later. Um, that's super selfish. Like, not because you're good means that you can't watch out for the person next door. That's not good, you know? And that's actually where I feel like, a lot of people that are kind hard hearted because like myself I, I'm always down to helping people I'm always down to you know being there for people but when it comes to people being there for me they're not there for real you know I lost so many friends in the past because I was super caring and they just weren't and I decided I, I felt like my energy was being taken advantage of which is the reason why I pushed myself away from them and yeah I just feel as though um, us in this world need to help each other. That's like the main important part, you know, of this video. We need to understand that not because we are good means that others are good. Trust me, I'm a student. I go to school full time. I work full time. You know, I'm, I, I wouldn't say I do struggle, but not as much as, you know, some other people. So, yes, I do struggle, but... For me to remove, you know, to take out my money that is already budgeted in a certain way to give to somebody, I think people that definitely have it out there should definitely do this. Like, come on now. Um, um, what else? I wanted to also touch base on ungratefulness. Like, I feel like a lot of people out here are ungrateful or, or they just feel as, you know, because they're not where they are, they're just, they're useless technically. God has put, if you, I feel like if you have where to stay, meaning where to sleep, if you have a food on your plate, I mean, if you have a food on your tail on the table, sorry, I'm getting into this so much. If you have food on the table for you to eat, you should be grateful. Just that alone, you should be very grateful because some people do not even have what to eat. They are like sitting, starving, hungry because they have nothing to eat. Sometimes we stay home. Hungry because we don't want it. it was in the fridge. Some people don't even have that option. So I feel like this is very, very important. Sorry, my mom is downstairs yelling. She's calling Jordan, but he's not even here. She thinks she's, he's upstairs, but he's not. Um, yeah. Uh, in a pala! Il est rentré depuis. Il est rentré. Quoi? Je suis en train de faire la 
vidéo. Tu m'appelles. So I just feel like um, some people do not have it. Some people just don't have it. At least we have the option to be like, oh, I don't want to eat what's in the fridge, so I'll just not eat today. Some people don't even have the option to have what's in your fridge and that you don't want to eat today. So I think that we should learn how to be more grateful, okay? The next point I want to touch based on is people that think that because they're not rich enough, they can't give to others. But I'll come back and touch based on that after I put my lashes on, okay? All right. So, guys, now that my lashes are on, let's touch base on the last topic, which is people that think that um, they have to be super rich or millionaires or have all the money they would like to have before they start giving back to others, okay? Because I know a lot of people that are like that when I, you know, mention. Because if you guys don't know, my sister and I and some friends of ours do have a non-profit organization where we donate things to um, people in need, like orphanages in um, third world countries. And we do that in the donation yearly, like every December, one of us travel down there. Um, we have done it in Africa already, Cameroon. Now we are trying to expand and push it to, you know, different places. So if you guys want to join, definitely DM me on Instagram or send me an email so we can talk about joining that group but i have a couple of people when i try to get them to join they told me oh how can i give to people when i myself don't have as much as i would like i was like what that doesn't even make any sense because you don't have all the money you would like to have you can't give like that's actually i personally feel like that's how you get blessed. By the way, I'm using my Boo Brightman Rocks highlight palette to highlight my inner corner, the inner corner of my eyes. So I'm like, I personally feel like whatever you believe in, whether it's in God or the universe or whatever it is, they thank you after you give to other people. And you get good karma for doing that because you have done your good deed. So the group actually... You know, I'm part of, you know, my sister and I and some friends are, you know, running. It's called Good Deed. And, yeah. So, you have already done your Good Deed. So, I, do, I you know, it's weird. It's very weird. I feel as though the little bit you have, you should be able to donate it to... Not, not give all your money or anything like that. Like, just a little bit, you know, once in a while to those in need. Go to an orphanage go to there's different uh, centers go go somewhere see an, a homeless a homeless in the on the street buy them a meal you know i really hope that all i'm saying this video someone takes it to heart and actually you know try to do the good deeds once in a while whenever they really can but for some people to say that they don't have as much as they would like that's what they can't give i just feel like that's bs okay straight up bs and that is the last point for this video. I'm getting ready to do my lip and put my highlight on. You know, I'm about to highlight this face. And then show you guys the goodie. I'm super excited. I can't wait to go slay, take some nice pictures. Woo -hoo. Can't wait to go take some nice picture in that shirt. So now, this is the moment we have all been waiting for. I'm done with my face. I fixed my hair. And yes, so here is the package. Yay! I'm so excited. So that's how it came. And you see, it, it says Shantania back forward right there. I don't know if you guys can see it. It says, that's how new was, you know, her package. And it's super cute. Because it's not plastic, it's actually a very nice paper um, wrap. So it opens like this, gets longer, and then of course it's you know sealed like that. But you open it, it makes a lot of noise. <laughs> All the way at the bottom and this is 
this shirt. There's something else in there. Oh, got it. It came with this. I believe that's like the invoice for your order. And um, it says, Hey, Gisland, thank you for helping end homelessness in UCC, my lovelies. I think she is it UK. I can't see that properly. I think it's UK or UCC. And then it says they. What I can't see that. Yeah, there's a word stay, and then everyone Shantania. And that is the little note that comes in. Pretty writing. So this cost me $26 in total because it was $19 and I got an extra large black one so it was 26 oh my bad I'm talking about dollars it was 26 euro <laughs> so yeah it was 19 euro remember it's UK so it's euros 19 euros and plus seven dollars of international shipping which is good seven euros sorry every time i say dollars is euros sorry and seven euros for international shipping total of 26 euros is right here so yeah i'm super excited thank you so much again for what you're doing and thank you for this beautiful i haven't seen this shirt oh my gosh <sighs> stay woke oh no, wait maybe that's what she meant to say here that's it she said thank you thank you hey just saying thank you for helping end homelessness the in the uk or ucc it looks like a k and like two c's i'm not sure my lovelies and she signed then said stay woke everyone shantania that's it got it but yes y'all y'all ready to see this baby Hmm, I don't think y'all ready, but ready or not, here it comes. Bam, this shirt is beautiful. It says, stay woke at the bottom, hashtag stay woke. And that's the face on the shirt. OMG is so pretty. And the details on the shirt, honey boo boo. Oh, I'm super excited. Thank you so much. I'm so happy. Like, I'm super happy. Can't wait to go rock some pictures in a few minutes in this shirt. So yes, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys got something out of it. You know, please help those in need. Thank you, Shantania, for your movement once again. It's awesome, wonderful. You are doing great. Keep going. Kudos to you. If you haven't gotten the shirt, make sure you get a shirt. I'll link um, the link where I got the shirt from down below because I'm definitely supporting this movement. I'm happy. That I got my shirt. I'm excited that I was able to, in some way, some shape or form, help and homeless homelessness. Once again, thank you for watching. If you are new, subscribe down below. It's free, okay? Free 99. Hit that subscribe button down below. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media platforms. That's Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. It will be on the screen and somewhere in the description box down below for your convenience. And I'll catch you guys on my next video. Bye. Au revoir. Mwah.